Messina. I'm from Argentina. I'm 16 and you're watching Fanfaloi. Enjoy. We've just woken up after like 12 hours of sleeping, which has been incredible, um, to this lovely home cooked breakfast. We have Cafe de Cuba. Got a bowl of fruit here. Do you want just your eggs fried, yeah? Just fried, yeah. yeah. I think this is guava juice. How's the guava juice fry? I've never had guava before. No? It's so good. This is tasty. I think that's a big pile of carrots. And this is the bread. Off to adventure. Check this motorbike with a sidecar out. I want one of these one day. All the roads have massive holes in them. Like, how could a car drive down there? This is ridiculous. So the area of Havana we're staying in is the old town, which is like a typical colonial Spanish place with like all the old style buildings, super colorful, but also kind of dilapidated, like it's kind of in need of repair. But that what, that's what makes it so beautiful as well. Also, there's all these old cars everywhere, which I was showing you yesterday. And this is from the embargo between the US, which stops them trading or importing cars, like new cars. So these all look from the 50s, when the Cuban Missile Crisis happened. Too many photo opportunities in Havana. Like every single street that I could just spend an hour in each street taking photos. So I'm a little bit overwhelmed to be honest. This is incredibly beautiful. Like, check this out, we just walked into the square, look at this. What? How are you doing, bro? You alright? Oh, the horse just bit me, you naughty horse. Don't bite me. No biting. Every single street corner have these awesome little bands playing like salsa, Cuban, Latin music. Awesome. Check this out guys, it's a little antique book market on this square. So Raya collects National Geographic magazines and these are all of them from 1935. It's like a collection of That's crazy. So it's all like in one big book? Yeah. From the whole year. We just got stopped in the street saying that we want to learn some sound stuff. And um, we've been learning some stuff online, but haven't been making much progress. So we're going to see if this is worth coming in here for a sound for lesson. It's going to be pretty awesome. <laughs> In someone's living room, yeah? They're gonna give us a demonstration. Yeah? Guys, I don't know whether this is the best plan, but we've just booked in five lessons each. That's five hours over the next today, tomorrow, the next three days. 
So we're doing one hour today, two hours tomorrow, and two hours the next day. Um, and hopefully by then we will be expert salsa dancers. That's the plan. That's the plan. Are you excited, Mariah? Yeah. <laughs> we're gonna get so good. We're gonna get so good. And we're gonna show up Dave. When Dave arrives, he's he's gonna be surprised at how good we are. I'm not entirely sure what these bears are, but each country is represented by a bear, so we've gone to find Bulgaria. And I want to find the UK as well. Have you found Bulgaria? Yes, Bulgaria. Rise from Bulgaria, if you guys didn't know. Hug the Bulgarian bear. <laughs> Here's the British bear. United Kingdom. Um, not too impressed. Not too impressed. Guys, look at these balconies being held up by wooden things. Looks like it's about to fall down. This was just a gaping hole last night. It looks like they're filling it with uh, cement. just popped into a shop. I'm looking for some cool shirts. Look. I'm thinking, um... Look my... Yeah? Okay, okay. I'm like, this could work, or we're thinking, like... No, I this, have different styles. Th this star. Style. Guys, I didn't find a shirt, but I think I might have found a hat that actually fits. We've been into like four different places, and I think we found one. I've got the full outfit now. So, trousers, shirt. I just need to wait for Ryan to come back to see which of these. He's going to get us ice cream. So I bought my outfit and Raya got back with this amazing coconut ice cream in a coconut shell. How awesome is this ice cream? Right, time for our first salsa lesson. Five, six, seven, say no. One, three, five, six, seven. Okay. Five, six, seven. learning a spin now. To right here, to All I have to do is lift my arm up and she has to spin. In place, in place, in place. This is what we're learning tomorrow, apparently. No way. First lesson done. That was amazing. I feel like we're actually going to get it. Did you enjoy that? Yeah, I think we're going to get it too. <laughs> Tomorrow's going to be intense apparently, so. Two hours. He said we're going to need Red Bull. We need to be drinking Red Bull. All right, let's go find some dinner. I think it's dinner time.
found our spot. We're gonna eat tonight. It's like this little square here. This, we're just chilling outside. This is perfect. And there's a band playing over there. And the waiter's just about to give us a menu. Hopefully the food's pretty good here too. Dinner has arrived. And we're getting serenaded as well. Right. What do you want? What do you want? Do you want this chicken? Do you want this chicken? You can't have this chicken. I got some chicken and I got a whole pizza for dinner because my appetite's quite big at the moment. But if I can't manage it all, I've got this little guy to help me out. Hey mate. Hello matey. We found a coffee house, so I've got myself a little coffee and I'm sharing a cake with Raya. This is, so good. what is this? Um, espresso cake apparently, but it tastes like espresso. Espresso cake? Yeah. Right, we have headed back to the house for the night and um, we've got, first thing in the morning, two hours of salsa lessons, which I could be quite tired for, but I'm also super excited that I'll be actually learning something and um, I won't look stupid on the dance floor, hopefully, um, after we finish this little salsa course. Um, also, we need to kind of be on the same level as Dave. Um, he's pretty good at the dancing. Um, so when he gets here, we'll, we can all go and rip up the dance floor, hit the clubs. We we'll still probably look like complete amateurs to all the locals, but I think we'll still be able to move. Um, that's the plan, anyway. Cool, right, um, I'll catch you guys in the morning, and uh, peace out, enjoy life, and live the adventure. Boom. <laughs>